All right, so welcome back. Today in this video, we're going to be continuing our water resources and environmental engineering uh, section of the review. And today we're gonna to be sp specifically looking at basic hydraulics. If you missed the previous video on basic hydrology, went over uh, rainfall, intensity, um, runoff, infiltration, all of those things, make sure that you check out that video as well. It goes over and highlights some stuff that they're definitely gonna ask you on the, on the exam. All right, so take a look at number one. Number one says calculate the velocity of water in a rectangular open channel with a Manning's roughness coefficient of 0 0.03, a channel slope of 0 0.001, and a hydraulic radius of two meters. All right, so what information do they give us, right? All right, so given information is we have a roughness coefficient. Rough coefficient. We also have uh, the channel slope, right? Which is 0 0.001, so channel slope. And we have the hydraulic uh, radius. Okay, what are we trying to find? We're trying to find, calculate the velocity of water. So we're trying to find the velocity of water. All right, formula is needed. Well, I know they give us something that's really that could be really crucial. So we know it's all we know that it's in an open rectangular or in a rectangular open channel and it has Manning's roughness coefficient. So we need to look up Manning. Because I don't know what Manning's Manning's equation. All right. Q is Q, discharge or flow. So I'm not really solving for flow, I'm looking for velocity. All right, let's look at the next equation. Um, v, what is V? Velocity, okay. What is K? K is, looks to be like a constant and a known value. So if we're using USCS, which is which would be like feet, we would be using 1.486, but we're using SI unit, so I know K is one, okay? Uh, do we have RH, the hydraulic radius? We have that, two meters, okay? And do we have S? S is slope, we have the channel slope. All right, so we have everything we need. So the formula would be V is equal to K over N. Uh, what's N? The roughness coefficient, which uh, we do have that as well. Okay. All right. Um, so K K over N, right? Uh, R sub H to the two thirds, and then times S to the one half power. Don't forget those two thirds and one half powers. They're very important. Um, and it can mess up your equation if you don't plug in everything correctly. Okay, so let's go ahead and write out what we know. So V is equal to question mark. We don't know that. K in this case is equal to one because we're in SI units. Uh, N, is equal to 0 0.03 r sub h put some commas between these r sub h is our hydraulic radius which equals two meters and um, s is the slope of the channel which is equal to 0 0.001 all right when we saw when we 
plug in our values, we get V is equal to one over 0 0.03 times two to the two over three, right? Times 0 0.001 all to the one half power. All right, and when I solve everything out, I get 1.67 meters per second. Or a. Hey everybody, I know I didn't take time to formally introduce myself at the beginning, so I did want to let you know who I am and how I can best serve you as you're studying for your civil FE exam. So my name is James Huntley and I am a civil engineer who has helped hundreds of individuals pass and dominate their civil FE exam. Now, I know this test is tough, and as you're going through material, you may be saying, Ugh, I don't remember learning this stuff, or gosh, these variables are so confusing, or you just feel like you're really, really busy, and there's so much material that you need to go through that it's a bit overwhelming. So I did want to let you know that I do help and work with individuals one-on-one -on -one to ensure that they pass their civil FE exam. And I've had individuals that have worked with me for 10 weeks, and that's the longest that it has been, and I've had individuals that have worked with me for two weeks, and we went back to back, day after day after day, hours on hours on hours, putting in the work, um, working together to ensure that they went ahead and passed, right? And this exam is so important because I know that you want to make more money. Um, I know that you want to, you know, get some promotions and be able to further your career and have your PE. So definitely want to open and extend a hand out want to be able to save you time, right? Because I know some people that watch my videos, you may have been watching my videos for six, nine, even 12 months, and you still haven't passed your civil FE exam. And that is the one thing that's keeping you from making more income, more impact, and furthering your career. So it's definitely costing you um, money, resources, everything. So looking to create more success stories, um, I am looking to work with individuals one-on-one. -on -one. I want to hop on Zoom with you. I want you to share what you're doing as you're solving these problems so I can spot out what you may be struggling with and open your eyes so that you're not going into this test completely blind. Now, for some of you, you may have failed a test once, twice, had some people fail five times, um, or you may be wanting to take this test initially, and you just wanna make sure that you pass it up front. So do have one-on-one -on -one services. I also have some uh, do-it-yourself uh, courses that if you're like, no, I got this, I got it all on my own, I know everything, or I, I'm gonna take the time to study everything, I do have some resources and materials to be able to help you in that way. But my biggest fear is that you're investing in something, uh, these programs or these courses and you know you're not uh, getting back or having proper feedback to help you and to push you forward you're just giving a bunch of information and no one's sharing with you what you may be actually struggling with or what's keeping you from passing your FE exam so looking to create a ton of success stories so feel free um, down in the description box below I have a ton of resources, including one-on-one -on -one coaching. Let's hop on a call. Uh, it's no cost to you as far as, you know, us talking through your goals and what you're trying to do um, and kind of getting a feel for where you're at. Um, so I have some programs where I can work with you one-on-one. -on -one, and there's also some do-it-yourself courses, practice exams, study guides, resources, Free material all of that down in the description box below so feel free to check out that stuff if you like the video be sure to hit that like button subscribe to the channel 
this is what I do. Um, we want to get you to the next phase of your civil engineering career. Um, and leave a comment if you had any questions about um, what I went through, the information that I covered. Um, and feel free to um, definitely schedule a call with me and looking forward to creating more success stories. So be sure to check out this next video.